Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Eric or Ninja XTX, and welcome to part four in my knife self defense uh, series. Today's video, or today's topic, is going to be respect for life. Now, respect for life comes from is a concept that comes from Master at Arms, James A. Keenan. If you don't know who I'm talking about, look him up on uh, YouTube. He's got a YouTube uh, channel, and a lot of my, a lot of my, my uh, mentors like Mark Davies or even Stephen Ledwith and Brian Canada know who I'm speaking of because they have trained with the band. And through them and through other avenues, I've had the opportunities to uh, see his, see some of his work and add it into my training. And I hope he does not mind. But one of the concepts I also, one of the concepts that I teach my students as well is respect for life. Now. Respect for life is this. You may draw your knife. You may use your knife. But it's the restraint in which you use said blade in an attack. Because, and I'm going to give you guys an example real quick. If you have someone that's attacking you and you cut or let's just say to use a Filipino term or, or a Filipino martial arts term defame the snake and then you say now I could have done worse get out of here um, and go Check on your wounds. That is taking care of the person. That is also part of your training because it's not just all all these movements. It's it's not just how you use the knife. It's what happens psychologically to you in a knife fight. Or a knife confrontation. It is whether it can often be the the difference in do you go to prison or can you articulate to the to the law enforcement, hey, I use this knife as a self-defense tool because my attacker was the aggressor. I wasn't. I used this knife to defend myself, but I let him know that he needed to go to the hospital to get the wounds looked at or I let him know that I looked at the wounds, I bandaged them, I used my training to bandage him up, and I sent him on his way. That is respect for life. The courts will look at that and say, yes, you used the strength when this man was trying to kill you. I hope that made sense for you guys. Please take care of yourselves and each other. One world, one love. If you have any questions, comments, or requests, please send them to my YouTube account. Or if you know how to get in touch with me on Facebook, please send them to my Facebook account. Thank y'all. Love y'all. Bye-bye.